Leslie, an Anglican evangelist, theologian, and co-founder of Methodist movement. I am from England and was born in the small town of Epworth. I wrote an essay titled The Scriptural Way of Salvation, which was published in 1765. The reason I wrote the essay, The Scriptural Way of Salvation, is to give people a depth understanding of what is salvation and way of salvation as we continue to grow in Christ. Let me briefly summarize what I said here about the way of salvation. What is salvation? This is not the souls going to paradise or in the other world. Salvation is the entire work of God through faith in Jesus Christ. The first step of salvation begins with original sin, effectively built by justification. Justification is another word for pardon and the forgiveness of all our sins. A repentant sinner before God becomes justified and original sin is directly dealt by justification, which is only possible by God and can only be known by faith. And at the same time that we are justified, in that very moment, sanctification begins. Although justified believer's sin is completely destroyed, the presence of sin in the believer's life is defeated by the next step in the order of sanctification, which is the process of change in the believer's life as we are born again from sinfulness unto holiness. And the final step in salvation is glorification. In other words, this involves changing of our mortal state to become like him. As 1 John chapter 3 verse 2 says, Dear friends, now we are children of God, and what we will be has not yet been made known. But we know that when Christ appears, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. Before I close my speech, Please remember, salvation is the entire work of God occurred by humanity's original sin, and this original sin is effectively dealing with justification, continues in sanctification, and ends with glorification. Thank you.